Hi there, my name's Vince from MyMateVince.com and in this video today I'm going to show you how you can set your phone up as a Wi-Fi hotspot to enable other devices to share its internet connection. So the good thing about using the Wi-Fi hotspot is you can connect numerous devices to it and it's better than USB tethering because you don't have to physically plug in a USB cable so you can move your phone to a better location in the house. So for example you can put this next to a window that you know where it gets good signal strength and then it will use the Wi-Fi between the laptop laptop and the phone or your iPod and the phone or whatever you're connecting up. So to set it up it's nice and straightforward. You go to this icon down here and then you need to go to the settings icon which is this one here and then you need to go to underneath wireless and networks you need to go to more. You will be able to do this on iOS as well on Apple devices. It's called a personal hotspot on Apple devices. This is an Android device and you need to go to where it says tethering and portable hotspot and it says set up Wi-Fi hotspot. So tap that one there and what you need to do is you need to have a look at your network name so this is VFD 900 and you also need to make a note of your password so if you click on show password at the moment I've changed it to test test. Your password you, you can change it to whatever you like so you can delete that and you can change it to whatever you want to change it to but you can, at, you can leave it at its default which will be just a series of numbers and letters but it's going to be harder to remember but it's absolutely fine you can do that and then it's up to you what band you use so I'm going to leave it on the 2.4 gigahertz on this phone I can change it to 5 gigahertz but a lot of items still are not 5 gigahertz enabled so this laptop here will only be 2.4 gigahertz but if you knew you were connecting to something that used the 5 gigahertz bands then you could do that because that channel is less congested congested and if this phone is going to be nearby your device you might well find that you get better speeds but for this video I'm leaving it on 2.4 and then what you need to do is just turn on portable Wi-Fi hotspot so turn that on there it takes a few seconds after you've clicked it to actually go through right so right now it is working as a hotspot and if you have a look up here you've got that little icon that looks like a target with a wedge taken out of it that means that the hotspot is now enabled. So let's put the phone down to one side and we're going to go onto the laptop and we need to connect to the Wi-Fi off the phone. So if we go down to the symbol down here, the Wi-Fi symbol, and if we left click, at the moment I'm not connected to anything, but if you have a look up here now, it says Vodafone 900, so that's my one here. Again, you can change that name to whatever you want to change it to. So I'm going to click on that and I'm going to go to connect. Okay, and right now we are now connected to the internet again. So if I was to go to the BBC website, bbc.co.uk, you will see now that it's using the internet from my phone to the laptop. So the laptop's not connected to anything else is purely connected to the Wi-Fi of my phone and I'm using the cellular data from the phone. So this is really handy if you're in an area with poor broadband connection or if you're away on holiday or a hotel or somewhere like that you can still get access to the internet from your phone. Okay thanks for watching please give it a thumbs up if you found it useful. Take care.